Hi guys, I'm next to the river. Today I'll be doing one experiment with the black sand. Can I do panning with the using black sand because and magnet? Because uh, we know everybody got gold is more heavy than black sand and everything else. So my idea is like this, if you get some sand in the bucket, okay, all even past that one eight mesh, I got some sand and I classify this sand material. Or maybe don't even need to classify, we'll see. And uh, then I put the water in the bucket and I spin it, spin it, this one, in one direction. All heavy materials must come somewhere in the center, okay? And then if you use a magnet, which one is just a regular mag microwave magnet from microwave? Where is that? Okay, like this. Let me get right. Idea is like this. When you spin the water, all heavy material goes to the center of this. Okay? And then all black sand, if there is sand, if not, you need to add black sand inside. And uh, not everywhere we have a sand. So right now I'm putting a little bit sand and be spinning and this magnet is supposed to stick on the bottom. So let's see how everything works. Let's make something. And let him stop. When he stops, then I put the magnet on the bottom. Okay. Let him stop. Right now, I be putting bucket on this magnet. Let's see how everything works. It's supposed to magnet if there is enough sand stick to bottom of this bucket. Okay. Let's see. Center up. You see, magnet is thick. Magnet is underneath the bottom. Okay, let me take water away. Right now I'll be taking water away. What I got? I got the black sand in the middle where exactly is my magnet. And I tried to take this sand away to the pan. Okay, let me do use you see, the I got the magnet holding all this black sand gold is heavier than that black sand is underneath that sand everything else i put it in that place so i'd be doing two or three times till all this black sand is gone and right now i'd be fanning this black sand I, of course I, I remove it with the magnet that black sand and we will see what's happening and the magnet it's holding, you see? Magnet holding in the bottom. Very well. Because of the sand. If I remove the sand, magnet falls down. So look what's happening. I remove the magnet up and everything release. Okay. So now I'm transferring everything to my panning stuff place. No one can, there's no work. I need to get some kind of stuff. Now I got everything transferred to the pan and I try collect all this black sand from this pan and we be panning and we will see how much gold we got. This is not a lot of gold, I just experimenting on the regular sand. There is gold but maybe it's very miserable. Um, something so everything is already here and let's do panning okay this way I planning to work on my microscopic gold what is there get the black sand and do the same thing and I want to see can I recover that gold with this over there? Now everything work. 
And look how much microscopic gold I catch it. This is microscopic gold, guys. This is super, super small, but it's a lot like, you see the yellow things? This is all the gold. Let me try to put it um, everything in one place. You see, this is a gold. What I talking about, what I couldn't recover another way. So magnet work. He catch that all gold. It came in the in the center, underneath the sand, underneath the black sand. And you see the gold is so small. If I look with the finger, compare, it's very, very small. This is of all pile of gold. Let me put the water a little bit, spread it. So this kind of gold I talking about. It's tannable, but if it's really, where is that? Can't even see. Okay, what well here, you see? This kind of size of gold, this is very, very small gold, but you see how many of this? If you figure out how to make that panning, you can get that gold out, easy. And now I'm playing with this magnet thing, adding like hand pull, no, two hands, let's say, pull. And I'm taking this black sand from the magnet and putting inside, because the sand don't have too much black sand, so I needed add some black sand to catch my gold. And you know what? It's working. And I'm very happy, so right now I'll be going home and thinking how to make uh, this everything work. Okay, right now I'll be panning. I'll be spinning right now that all sand with the black sand inside, like this, and try to make a center. And I'm putting on the magnet, you see magnet underneath? Okay and everything settles down, the magnet sticks to the bottom, no. Didn't stick, not enough black sand. But, one more time. Add more sand to cover all the gold. Okay. Oh, now it got stuck. Okay. So let me take a water away now. Start how this looks when the magnet is thick. I have big pile of black sand. Gold is underneath in the center. And this is everything, sand is useless, you can throw it. So right now I'm transferring everything what's left inside the pan. Okay, magnet holding. See on the bottom? Oh, fell down. Okay, it's not enough. It's a problem with this bucket. It have some kind of rib. Don't let me go all the way. So now I'm transferring everything here. One can, this one can. Guys, sorry. I just tried to show you after I don't even show you anymore. Okay, guys. <laughs> I finished with the experiments today next to the river because it's very hard to work. It's hot and uh, no comfortable, no table, no nothing. But figure out one thing that that sand works very well. You know, main thing, because when you're spinning the water, all the gold goes in the bottom of this uh, bucket and black sand covers them. And when you're adding magnet, it's like squeezes that, catches that gold and holds because, you know, magnet is actually strong enough to hold that black sand in place. And when you continue spinning, you throw the water with the old sand 
out that black sand stays in the same position. So that means your all gold, what you catch it, is there. And you just need to, after remove that black sand with the same magnet and pan it. Actually, when I do chemical, uh, then I don't even need to pan it too much. I just remove that black sand and I can put aqua regia and dissolve it and precipitate that gold. So what I can say guys, uh, everything we need to try until we figure out something to work. And it looks like this thing is working. Tomorrow I'll be spending all day. We will see how everything works on my microscopic gold. And I try on my sand, which one contains a lot of gold. And I got the gold too. So that means everything perfectly working with that black sand. Just one problem. Uh, not every way is that black sand. When you pan, try to pan, sometimes it's no black sand. So that that way, you need to have a like little amount of black sand from somewhere else. Then adding, and you can work with that black sand. So, guys, I'm happy. Good results. You can do it the same way. Try it, and we'll see what we can get. And if somebody already doing something, let me know, because uh, it's a lot of questions still. And I thinking maybe we can make some kind of tool to easy our job to pan the gold using that black sand and magnet. So, <laughs> okay, thank you guys. Uh, see you next time, okay?